understanding the negative effects of masturbation for men and women. Welcome back, fellow explorers of the human experience. Today, we're delving into a topic often shrouded in taboo and misconception masturbation. But hold on to your hats, because we're not just scratching the surface, we're diving deep into the intricate web of its effects on both men and women. From physical health to mental well-being, join us as we uncover the nuanced landscape of self-pleasure and its potential impacts. Brace yourselves for a journey that promises to challenge assumptions, spark thought-provoking discussions, and ultimately shed light on the lesser-known consequences of this ubiquitous act. So grab a seat and get ready to broaden your understanding as we navigate through the maze of the negative effects of masturbation for both men and women. Our introduction to masturbation. Masturbation is a common and natural activity practiced by individuals across various cultures and societies. It involves the self-stimulation of the genitals, typically resulting in sexual pleasure and, often, orgasm. Both men and women engage in this practice, and it is widely recognized as a normal part of human sexuality. Studies indicate that a significant percentage of the population, regardless of gender, masturbates at some point in their lives. Societal views on masturbation have evolved significantly over time. Historically, many cultures viewed masturbation with suspicion or outright condemnation, often associating it with moral or physical deterioration. However, in contemporary society, attitudes have become more accepting. Medical professionals and sex educators frequently emphasize that masturbation is a healthy way to explore one's own body, relieve sexual tension, and even promote better sleep and stress relief. In the following sections, we will delve deeper into these negative effects, examining how they manifest in both men and women. By doing so, we aim to provide a comprehensive understanding of the complexities surrounding masturbation ensuring that individuals are better informed and able to make conscious decisions about their sexual health. Psychological Effects Excessive masturbation can have significant psychological effects on individuals, stemming from both personal beliefs and cultural norms. One of the most common psychological impacts is the feeling of guilt. Many men and women grow up in environments where sexual activities, including masturbation, are deemed inappropriate or sinful. This cultural stigma can lead to feelings of guilt each time the act is carried out, making it difficult for individuals to reconcile their natural urges with the imposed moral standards. Closely related to guilt is the sense of shame. The secrecy often surrounding masturbation can amplify feelings of embarrassment and shame. Individuals might feel isolated, believing they are the only ones engaging in such behavior, which can affect their self-esteem and overall mental health. The fear of being judged or ridiculed if discovered can exacerbate these feelings, leading to heightened anxiety levels. Moreover, these psychological effects can contribute to a deteriorating self-image. Continual feelings of guilt, shame, and anxiety can erode self-esteem, making individuals view themselves negatively. This decline in self-worth can hinder personal growth and affect one's ability to engage in healthy relationships. It is crucial to maintain a balanced and healthy mindset regarding sexual activities. Understanding that masturbation, in moderation, is a natural part of human sexuality can help alleviate some of the psychological burdens. Promoting open conversations and education around this subject can assist in reducing the stigma and fostering a more accepting attitude, ultimately contributing to better mental health and self-esteem. Physical Health Concerns While masturbation is a natural activity, Excessive masturbation can lead to various physical health concerns. One of the primary issues associated with frequent masturbation is genital irritation. Men and women may experience soreness, redness, or even minor abrasions due to repeated friction. This irritation can lead to discomfort and may require a period of abstinence to heal properly. Chronic fatigue is another concern that arises from excessive masturbation. Engaging in this activity too often can deplete the body's energy reserves, leading to a constant feeling of tiredness. This fatigue can impact daily activities, productivity, and overall well-being. It's crucial to recognize the body's limits and ensure that energy levels are maintained for other essential activities. It's important to differentiate between moderate and excessive masturbation. Moderate masturbation, when done occasionally, does not typically lead to these physical health problems. It can be a healthy part of one's sexual life, providing stress relief and pleasure. However, when masturbation becomes excessive, it can start to interfere with daily life and physical health. Recognizing the signs of excessive masturbation and addressing them early can help prevent these negative outcomes. 
understanding the balance is key. Moderation ensures that the benefits of masturbation can be enjoyed without the accompanying physical health concerns. If issues persist, seeking advice from a healthcare professional can provide guidance and support for maintaining a healthy sexual lifestyle. Impact on relationships. Excessive or secretive masturbation can have profound implications on intimate relationships, affecting both men and women in various ways. One of the primary concerns is the potential for decreased sexual intimacy with partners. When an individual frequently engages in masturbation, it may lead to a diminished desire for sexual activity with their partner. This can create a sense of neglect or rejection, causing emotional strain and distance between partners. Sexual dysfunction is a significant concern when it comes to the negative effects of excessive masturbation. For men, one of the most commonly discussed issues is erectile dysfunction. This condition can be exacerbated by frequent masturbation, particularly when it is combined with the habitual consumption of pornography. Pornography can create unrealistic expectations about sexual performance and body image, leading to a diminished ability to achieve or maintain an erection without visual or mental stimulation from pornographic material. In women, excessive masturbation can lead to decreased sexual arousal. This can be attributed to the desensitization of the genital area due to frequent stimulation. As with men, the use of pornography can play a substantial role in this process. Women might find themselves comparing their own sexual experiences with the exaggerated scenarios often depicted in porn, resulting in a reduced ability to become aroused during real-life sexual encounters. Addiction and compulsivity. Masturbation, while often considered a normal and healthy sexual activity, can become problematic when it reaches the level of addiction or compulsivity. Masturbation addiction, also known as compulsive masturbation, is characterized by an overwhelming urge to engage in the behavior to the detriment of other aspects of life. This compulsion can manifest through various signs and symptoms, significantly impacting an individual's daily routine, relationships, and mental health. One of the primary signs of masturbation addiction is the inability to control the frequency or duration of the activity. Individuals may find themselves spending excessive amounts of time masturbating, even when it interferes with work, social interactions, or other responsibilities. This compulsive behavior often leads to feelings of shame, guilt, and frustration, contributing to a cycle of negative emotions that can be challenging to break. The psychological and emotional toll of masturbation addiction can be profound. Individuals may experience heightened levels of anxiety, depression, and low self-esteem as a result of their inability to control the behavior. The secrecy and isolation that often accompany compulsive masturbation can further exacerbate these feelings, creating a sense of loneliness and disconnection from others. Coping Strategies and Healthy Sexual Habits Maintaining a healthy balance in sexual habits is paramount for overall well-being. To manage urges effectively, it is crucial to adopt strategies that promote physical and emotional health. One practical approach is engaging in regular physical activity. Exercise not only serves as a distraction, but also helps in regulating hormones, which can reduce the frequency and intensity of sexual urges. Open communication with partners is another essential aspect of maintaining healthy sexual habits. Discussing sexual desires and boundaries can foster mutual understanding and respect, thereby reducing the pressure that may lead to unhealthy practices. It is important to create a safe space where both partners feel comfortable sharing their feelings without judgment. Thank you for joining us on this eye-opening journey through the complexities of masturbation's impact on both genders. Remember, knowledge is power, and by understanding the potential negative effects, we empower ourselves to make informed choices for our health and well-being. Let's continue these important conversations, challenge stigmas, and strive for a more open, honest dialogue surrounding sexuality and self-care. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more thought-provoking content. Until next time, stay curious and stay informed.